Hello Aquarius, welcome to my channel. This will be a reading for the week of the 11th of April. Please do bear in mind that these are general readings so may not resonate for everybody. So do take what does and leave what doesn't. Um, if you like the reading, please do like, share and subscribe. I very much appreciate that. So for this week, I will be divining through rice. It's a very ancient form of divination found... Um, in several different countries from North India, tri different tribes in North India, all the way through to Japan, uh, Shintoism they use it, where they cook the rice and have their methods. So I will be using uh, raw rice for, for today and I'll be pulling out some uh, cards as well towards the end. Okay, I love using rice. It's a very powerful um, medium to use. All right, Aquarius, let, let us begin. Aquarius, please. Hmm. Okay. There seems to have been lots of interruptions um, coming your way recently. It doesn't stop you, prevent you from, from continuing what you're doing, continuing your job or anything like that, really. But it just it's been a little bit... Um, back and forth, back and forth recently. Uh, but that I, I see this, there's a stage that is, you're moving into a different stage. Um, things will be flowing a lot better. There's a certain method with how you deal with things that you found is really, really good for you. Um, and you do certain things that perhaps, uh, not many people understand it's it's your it's you know you found your own kind of mechanisms to cope and deal with different situations and there's something i'm seeing here like a method there is a method to your madness so to speak it's a compliment it's a compliment so not everybody would understand that but perhaps you will understand that and and there is a certain appreciation like you know there's there's a certain quirkiness there that's very very endearing and lovable about you um, <laughs> and, and you're, you're, I see here, you have s several paths here that you're taking and you, I see that you're on a mission, um, and there's no giving up whatsoever. You know, there's, it's not just one path that you're on, you're on several and you're absolutely, um, determined to reach your goal which is absolutely happening i'm seeing big signs from the universe coming in for you i'm seeing um something to do with your belief system there's been lots of mysteries and mysterious ways uh, around you um things that you find coincident well the things that are you know you you can't uh see it as a coincidence it's more like well this was this came f just for you, whatever it is that you, you, you found yourself in or that you saw a certain sign. So there's lots of mysteries. And, and I do see that those things will be revealed to you as to um, why certain things have been happening. So I, I see you being a lot more in tune with the universe. I see that you're able to really um, gain a lot of clarity into difficult situations and onto the next steps that you're taking. Like there's there's a much deeper understanding and a lot more clarity. Also clarity as to why certain relationships are um, seems to be turning a, a, a different way. Some with some relationships I see that it, it's becoming well, this could be friendships, this could be, you know, family or uh, but I, I see there's like, a, with some, there's a bit more of a distance and with others, it's getting um, closer. So there's, there's a shift here, this big shift in the energy with the people around you, you connected to the other people. It's all very, very different. Um, it's like the other way around, if that makes sense. Mm -hmm. But there is a, um, a decision here I'm seeing that uh, it for some it may be a very hard choice to make um, and you being so in tune with yourself and the universe like spiritually being in tune 
Um, I, I see you really trusting everything that is happening. You're trusting, uh, you're, you're trusting the universe. You're letting go and um, very, very open to receiving whatever answers that there may be to help you in your decision making. You know, I hope that makes sense. Like, um, if you if you do come across something that's very difficult for you to make up your mind, you whatever it is that you feel deep deep down, that is the right solution, uh, and and those answers will reveal in good time. There, for some, there seems to be a fear of rejection of some kind, uh, possibly like um, uh, a. a a new society or community, an area, there's something there. Um, there's absolutely nothing for you to worry about. Again, there, there is many, many things about you that's very endearing. And people will fall in love with you, you know. Um, those that, that don't or, you know, are not interested... I mean, it's their loss, you know, so uh, you have nothing to worry about whatsoever. There is definitely, um, there's clarity again coming in with something that's going to be revealed to you. There's a truth that's going to be revealed and it's, it may come in a very unexpected way. Something that you really were not expecting. And... Um, it, 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 you know, may just come out of left field, just something that you wished you had known earlier, but it doesn't really affect you too much. It's just, it's just something that uh, a, a, a deeper understanding, more knowledge gained in regards to a certain situation, um, but it's 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 somebody or it's a group of people that that you are very closely connected to, in whichever way. I am seeing uh, acknowledgement here also for you, Aquarius. There's lots of acknowledgement that is coming your way um, for your for good work done, and um, I'm seeing a lot of hospitality. You may be in the hospitality industry or. Uh, there's like lots of compassion and care there. So maybe in, in that kind of field or there's, there's something there where you give a lot of your heart to many, many people. This could be through art as well. That is also another way. Um, but something where you are, the, you know, the... You're there for for many many people, and whether that's just a, a smile, you know, you could be someone that likes to smile to people in the street, and that brightens up their day. Or you could be on a certain platform or something that you uh, spread a lot of positive energy, and I see that coming back to you a lot. Okay, I do see revelations coming in, Aquarius. Certain revelations coming in, especially that unexpected one. But okay, you have um, you do have good support. Also, you will never ever be on your own, regardless. Like even if you don't actually have anybody that you live with or anything like that, just spiritually, you're not alone. You are not alone by far. Like I, I feel like uh, you can sense, you know. Um, your ancestors or or your guides with you it's it's very 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 they're very very close to you they're very they've come closer and closer okay Aquarius let's see what the cards have for you knight of pentacles ace of cups mm -hmm. and the two of pentacles so you are, as I said, you have several different paths. And I there's there's there is a mountain of blessings really coming your way. You know, certain things you've had to fight for. Um 
and you fought passionately about, I'm seeing here with the Knight of Pentacles. And uh, however long it took, it was well, well worth it. Well worth it. There's a lot of love around you. Lots of really great opportunities around you that you really, you've created for yourself because of of the things that you can provide, um, that you can show your talents, your skills. But also there's that compassionate side that, that's coming out a lot here as well. And with the two of pentacles, you know, you, you, I see here that you're multi-talented Aquarius. So there's many things that perhaps you feel like you need to juggle because you, you're able to balance out the yin and the yang, you know, the logical mind with the, with, with, with your heart, with the emotional side. And you do about, oh, the high priestess and the moon. Oh my goodness. Isn't this amazing? I was talking about your, your spirituality here, that the guides are very close to your angels or spirits. We have the high priestess and the moon. Very, very spiritual cards here. And that you're in tune with the universe. This is very powerful. You're getting to know yourself on a much deeper level. Much much more than, than perhaps you realized or that you ever thought you would be. It's just a, it's, it's a whole different stage here. And with the moon, I'm, I'm guessing again these revelations, an awakening of oneself. We have the devil. I sense here with the devil, the stronger and wiser and more awakened you get, sometimes that's when the more um, temptations there are around us like to test you, to, to get yourself further away from that, you know? But uh, that's, that's just, I don't believe that that's going to happen to you because there's a lot of strength here. There's a lot of um, you know, protection around you as well. If, you're, if, you're, if you have that kind of clarity and your eyes open, that's not going to happen to you. You know, there's, there's a ah, queen of swords. There's too much at stake for you in your near future. And on those several different positive paths for you to, to, um, ignore, you know, to do anything about. So, or, or to go the opposite way And here with the queen of swords. Yeah, no way. The queen of swords is a very powerful figure. You know, and she can just cut straight through the devil. Like, this is you. Nothing's going to stop you from getting to your end result here. And your end result is just the beginning. That's just the beginning. Um, I, I just see you having, like, you're, you're rising. And it's, it's like this um, uh, ripple effect you know, your energy creates a ripple effect across the room or across wherever that you are. When you step into a room, when you walk into a room and you are in a good mood, everybody feels it and it brightens everybody up. And then when you're in a bad mood, uh, everybody feels that <laughs> and they feel a little bit down. But it, it, I'm, I'm basically saying that's how strong your energy is. I'm seeing multiple opportunities business-wise as well Aquarius for you brilliant there's a lot of powerful things here and it's a very spiritual one as well all right Aquarius well um I hope that that did help there was a lot of messages coming out and that I was seeing so um I hope I hope it did help and I hope that you enjoyed it um please do take care of yourselves thank you all so much for your support for your donations. I truly, truly appreciate it. Please do take care of yourselves and until the next time, thank you all.